it is good to see you. What can I do for you? Would you like to renew your forces with excellent fighters? One, activate Lori's movement talisman. You and your daughter need to have a serious conversation. The spinner of nightmares appears beside you. She looks at her father anxiously. Dad, I want this feud to be over. You found Lori. By the gods, you brought her back to me, but... Hillor leans forward to embrace his daughter, but then stops as if he'd hit a wall. No, you are not Lori. You're the spinner of nightmares. Hillor clutches his head with his hands as if trying to hold back this dawning truth. You're both. My daughter, murderer, demon worshiper, traitor. All you. Hillor looks at his daughter, stunned. The walls he'd erected come crumbling down. Anger gradually replaces confusion in Hillor's eyes. His voice roars. Lori, how? How could you? What have you become? You, I saw what you did. I followed your trail and I saw all those bodies, all those madmen, the abomination you created. Why? If your mother... Lori puts an end to Hillor's rage with a sharp slap to the face. She squints and hisses viciously. Don't you dare drag mom into this. She wanted me to be happy, but you turned her into an idol and wanted me to sacrifice my life to her. Chaotic. Oh, how about a fight? Don't hold back. Enraged. Hiller grabs his daughter by her clothes and roars right into her face. If only she'd seen what you turned into, what you did with your life, she would die again. Lori lets out a horrible scream, like a tigress seeing her cub killed. Her thin fingers clench the handle of her dagger, and with one confident movement, she buries the blade in Hillor's chest. <laughs> Hillor seems baffled by the dagger sticking out of his chest. Still clenching Lori's clothes, he suddenly stiffens his grip and heaves mightily. The spinner of Nightmare's head flops backward with a wretched crack. The back of her head nearly brushes her shoulder blades. Blood spurts generously from her lips and life rapidly seeps from her glassy eyes. Hillor's fingers relax and the girl drops to the floor like a bag of rags. The Pathfinder slowly places both hands of the handle of the dagger and starts to pull. After a monstrous, endless moment full of grinding teeth and dark red blood, he draws the blade from his flesh. Blood gushes from the unplugged wound. Hiller drops heavy to his knees, looking at his daughter's corpse with terror. Lori, my girl. Hiller's heavy, muscular body drops to the floor with a thud. The little monocle falls from his pocket and rolls to the floor with a loud, ominous tinkling. 